Welcome Unicums and soon to be Unicums. I'm OK Vader and in this video what I'm going to be going over today is map awareness. Now what I notice a lot of people struggle with is just tunneling a certain area and not paying attention to what's going around you. So for this video that's what I'm going to be focusing on. Today's replay is going to be coming from Hated Fate. He's from my clan Rain, and he's going to be playing at the IS3 Defender for you guys today. And he's going to decide to go towards the heavy lane here. Now, I usually don't like to go towards the heavy lane. However, I am looking at his lineup, and I'm seeing that his team has no meds. And that is why I think it's fine to go towards the heavy lane in his case. Now, what he's going to be doing is he's going to be pushing with his heavies here. And what I want you guys to notice is that he's not playing too overly aggressive. He's staying in a position where he can reload his clip because he knows that his gun has a long clip reload. So from this distance he's going to be able to maximize his effectiveness and it's not until he has his clip fully reloaded that he's going to move up and he's always prioritizing the lowest HP targets. As you guys see here he's going to go for a Tiger P and every time a red posts up like on that little uh that little red arrow next to uh next to your reload bar every time something pops up there he's always looking in that direction making sure that he knows what is going on around him he's never just looking at one direction pushing ahead and not looking behind him he's always making sure just like you guys see here he's always making sure that he's paying attention to what's going on around him now from this position what he's effectively doing is he's making sure that he's covering his rear from the enemy with this building and now he's going to focus on what's behind him after he knows that the front push is basically one. Now look at this awareness. What most people would go do is go straight for that Tiger 1. However, he looks towards the left side and is able to catch that T-49 off guard because that guy thinks that Hated Fate is going to be going for his Tiger 1. He finishes off the T-49 T-49 and now he's going to be able to relocate back into cover to re reload his clip. And it's just setting yourself up for these opportunities where you can fully reload your clip while being in a position where you can cover yourself from the enemy. And what Hay of Fate is doing is exactly that. And now he's just going to be pushing ahead for his Tiger 1. He's just prioritizing the low HP targets here because even though this Tiger 1 may be a tier 7, it still has a very good gun that can pen Hated Fate. And because of that prioritization, he is now able to turn around and focus his attention onto this FCM, which is pushing behind him. He's always making sure that he has the FCM in front of him instead of behind him with that maneuver that he just did. And now he's going to be able to go for his FCM. This FCM just got tracked he's not even able to relocate and it's just a matter of time until hated ends up taking this guy out he's already racked up 5,000 damage any more damage is just a cherry on top he's gonna take this guy out securing three kills 5,085 damage and I believe this is a mastery don't quote me on this but yep that's a mastery, that's a high caliber, that's a confederate medal. He's going to secure 119,000 credits. Great game from Hate of Fate. Hopefully you guys learned something from this video. If you did, don't forget to hit that like button. It really just shows that you're supporting what I'm doing. And if you really want to support what I'm doing, hit that subscribe button. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.